Hello friends, in today's video I'm going to show you how I made these gorgeous 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 hoop earrings. How cute. And I really need to apologize for the lightning. It's not going to be the greatest one but I've got to work with what I have. It's really hard to get a sunny day now and but I really wanted to show you how I make these earrings because they're absolutely stunning. Imagine these ones in the summer with like a flower dress. Cute. Anyways, let's get started. The things that I'm going to use are two different pliers. These ones are to cut the wire and then these ones are just to hide the little wire ends. Then I have four different colors of Miyuki beads. I have this like bright yellow orangey color. Then I have mint i call them mint color and then this one is like a salmon and then i have silver color and all of these are miyuki beads size 11-0 then i have some silver color copper wire like this and the size is 0 0.4 millimeter and then i have some hoops and obviously i'm going to be using a mat as well just to make sure that if i drop any beads they don't go flying. First things first, I'm going to take the wire and I'm going to cut and I'm going to cut about 80 centimeters. I honestly, I'm not sure if I don't need less because it's the second time I'm going to make these earrings. So we will see at the end. Before we start making the haul, if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel and big, give me a big thumbs up. It would just mean the world to me because the support I have been given now is just amazing and it just helps me keep going and doing what I do. The first thing was cutting the wire, so as I said, 80 centimeters. Now I'm going to start with wrapping the wire around the hoop and the way I do it, put the wire on the back hold it down and then you take it and you just kind of like move it through the gap here and then you wrap it around and make sure you do it like quite tight you just keep wrapping it around yeah so you take it Put it here through the gap and then wrap it around. Then again, put it here through the gap and wrap it around. So this is how it looks right now. And I'm just going to take the pliers and I'm going to push the wire like on the very end. And I still keep this extra there. And I wrapped it around like seven times. So now I'm going to take the middle bead of the flower, which I use the silver color beads and just put it on the wire. And drag it down. And this is how it looks now. And then you just wrap the wire around the hoop again. Only now you have the silver bead. So you can hold it down so it kind of like stays in the middle and then you do the same thing you just put it through the gap and pull it back up like so if this is in your way you can always cut it down and then hide the little end by just folding it down okay so now the first flower i'm gonna take the yellow beads and i'm gonna put seven beads on but i'm only putting seven beads because i use miyuki size 11-0 if you use any other beads you're obviously gonna need to adjust it depending on the middle bead does that make sense because like if i have bigger beads obviously i'm not going to be putting seven on i would be putting less so now i need to wrap this 
around the silver bead so the way i'm going to do it i'm going to go through this side and just go it around so i'm going like this and just sort of like try and make a circle like so you just need to always like Make sure that it's very tight because if you, it's quite loose, then obviously the flower is not going to look very pretty. So now you can wrap the wire around the hoop again six times. And then you can just hold down the flower and just wrap it as we did in the beginning. One, two, three. So now you can see it's like a tiny bit loose, but you can always just like push the wire and it's and it's just like gonna tie it up. And now we're gonna take the silver bead again, put it on the wire and just wrap it the wire around the hoop again. like so and now i'm going to take next color and it's going to be that green color well i call it mint but it's like green blue color and i'm going to take seven beads again And now I'm going to wrap it around the silver bead again. So I'm going to go this way around and just make sure you do it like very tight. And wrap it around the hoop. Like so. And now we wrap it around six times as we did before, just to make sure that we have sort of like the same gap between each flower. Okay, and if we push it together, it like looks like this. And now we take another silver bead, wrap it around, like so. And now I'm going to take seven salmon slash pink color beads and pull them on the wire. And now wrap them around the silver bead the same way, like so. And now wrap the wire around the hoop. Two, three, four, five, and six. So this is how far we have got now. We did three flowers. Now I'm just going to make the whole earring and then show you the final result. So here is the final result. So cute. And for some of these are just perfect. And remember you can always mix and match the colors as always.
If you enjoyed this video, please give me a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you next time. Bye!